Hello, friends and fellow adventurers. Okay, we've got a, a giant treant over here. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to roll on in here to these midges. That's where they are, right? Oh, these are... Yeah, okay, good. Keep following me. This is good. So the treant is just... The treant's like, uh, look, at I'm like 700. Treant, protect me. Protect me with your awesomeness. Oh, did they run away? They ran away. Oh, uh, they wouldn't fight the tree. They were like, nope. Oh, this isn't good. I see a stinky graveyard. Is Have I been here already? Is this the crypt of... Death and Nalia? Uh, Jaller or graveyard? I don't think I've been here. Oh, hello. Why, hello. The Divine Harp. Oh, yeah. Play the Divine Tune to access sealed areas in the Rorter Woodlands. Ah, <sighs> whoa. Okay. That's cool. And we've got apples. That is really cool. Exciting. Oh, I'm very intrigued. I like that music is like even uh, uplifts our spirits. Oh, that's all the apples I can eat, really? She could take out some of these graves or something. Can we get in this joint? And if we can, is there anything we can do in here? Uh, I can sit down, I can have a little rest, and go upstairs. I can probably steal another candle. Nothing. Sorry, as I throw my, uh, oh my gosh, I, I make everyone, including myself, very ill. Let's have a sit. Oh, it's been a long day. I feel like sometimes all I do is run and run. Okay, I gotta go keep running. Keep running. And this evil thing here, I guess there's nothing for me to do. I'm not 100% sure if you get a notification like, hey, you should do something here. You should definitely try to do something here. I'm not sure if that's a thing. Okay, and now in terms of our, uh, where I want to travel, am I going towards the sea? I kind of would like to go see the coast. So, you know, I am going to go this way. <laughs> like my, my indecision. Which way to run? I want to, I don't want to go into the, um, the, the frozen lands again. What are those up there? Those are unpleasant. Whatever they are. That's super exciting that we got ourselves a harp. Oh, I like that. Yeah, it shows up. So we'll ha I have no idea what the, what the harp is going to do for us. Dude, we have the, a harp. Would you want a pet? No? Okay. I'm going to let you be. You seem like you maybe got some stuff you're thinking. You got some deep thoughts going on. You just, you want to be left alone. Like whenever I catch something out, even remotely out of the corner of my eye, I'm like, grab it. But then it can never get it. Because we're all full, filled up. All filled up. So this, oh, we're back on the road. What are these critters? No, cormorant. Nope. Keep on going. All right. So yeah, let's see if we can get, I, I want to reach the coast and then I want to see what's going on if maybe we hug the coastline a little bit. Oh, we've got ourselves another big manor over here. What is this about? There are some unpleasant giants over here. Oh, the graveyard. Unholy pact. Okay. Okay, so I don't know what the deal is here. Oh, this is a very tiny staircase. In fact, it's not. <laughs> it's just a design. Now, I do wonder what, like, if we were to light up candles or do something here, if that 
does a thing? I don't know. Because um, we do have a... Oh, let's go here. We're going to put that into our... No. Oh. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, so if you hit the center thing... Huh. Nope. All right, we just dropped it. That's not nothing successful. That's cool. What is it? Can I steal it? Fall. And run. Oh, I actually want to keep going this way, don't I? Okay. Because I was, I was heading coastbound. I just want to avoid these things. Oh my gosh. What other goodies do we have? Well, I see a little bush down there. Let's go let's get some wood as we go along. So I'm wondering what else we're, this area holds for us. So I'm assuming every area must have the same... If everything is... There's region lock on stuff. There must be also a city in each region. A um, The ability to get a shrine or a... Uh, um, whatchamacallit like uh, the the harp or um, different resources like the uh, the climbing shoes, whatever you call those things, climbing spikes or the um, wind glider oh it's another tree, that's what it oh no 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 okay can we get these, these things were like hidden they were secret okay now we, can we grab these lemons no. Yeah, I like this. Take them out of trees. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. You gotta be kidding me. I was, I was so busy looking at what else that thing was doing. Okay, we can't get these lemons. Um, all right. So I think what I'm going to do, is I'm going to continue going actually more this way. I'll kind of come around, but from a different direction. That's a pity. Those things, those trees were totally whooping. But it was intriguing that those other critters were um, invisible. That's totally annoying. Let's follow this road here see where this goes so I don't know if those were like brigands or or some kind of like road thieves <laughs> whatever I don't even what, what do you call them oh hold the phone no you know what I do want to go this way because we want to go this is going to take me more central though I think I'll hang a left here what is that a mana deer oh that's cool Look at you. What is your... You're 400. Oh, man, dear. You're beautiful. What are these dudes? Oh, these dudes are not powerful. You guys are weak. What? They one-hitted me. Okay. I don't care for it. I feel like mana deer would have something to say about this. Mana deer. So that was, I was heading uh, heading back this way. That's not them, is it? No. That's some other, what is that? Oh, that's uh, alpha dogs. And then, okay, so that's all my dog friends. Yeah, you're good. You, who's a good doggo? You're a good doggo. You are. Now stay clear, because I'm going to kill this bush. Don't want to accidentally strafe somebody and get attacked by wild dogs. Very nice. Got some logs. Okay. Oh. Oh, wow. This thing is... This cotton plant is... Uh, was tough. Okay, so this is good. If I can get some cotton out of this, too. So is there any more cotton plants around here? Now i got to keep my eyes open. Is that another one? 
these areas, and that's the hard part too, is I'm not really remembering what area contains what. I'm not taking notes, which I've, I'm now getting the sense I really should have been paying more attention to what region contains what. I had no idea it would be, whoa, that is a valley. Oh my gosh, what is that over there? That looks like... Uh, that looks like some kind of big boss battle mess. But also it looks like there's could be some kind of like caving situation going on here. Oh, no, 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 no. Careful going down like that. Corian Sanctuary. I do not know. Okay, so I'm good with that stuff. Wow. Oh my gosh. This is quite the thing. So I'm not even sure what the best approach should be. Do I find an easier, easier approach perhaps? Yeah, this looks a lot easier. Um, maybe. I don't know. I don't know if this is going to be an easily accessible thing. Be a lot of climbing. Possibly a lot of falling. Oh. See that? That's the issue. Okay, then we just keep going like this, I guess. We just let it regen just a tiny bit. Okay, yeah, I can do that. Okay, now we can climb up. There we go. And now I feel like I'm pretty quickly going to have to go into stealth mode. What is this? Oh, some lore. Ah, <gasps> what is this? Maybe you can help me. Oh no, what's going on? Talk, and then... Wood key. It needs a wood key. Benrold spent his early life in the mountains. One day he decided to make a journey to Narok Ocean. There he fought against the Steel Empire. Okay, that's it. Okay. So this little guy here, oh, he is trapped. So I need to get a wood key for him. Where am I gonna get a wood key? Huh. I wonder if that's gonna be a thing I can like craft or is that thing I'm gonna have to like, I don't know. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> I'm like gonna cost this guy uh, his freedom. Okay, so a wood key, huh? Huh. Let's see here. I don't suspect that's a thing I can craft. I feel like it's a thing I'm gonna have to find. Or, like, does somebody around here have a wood key? Probably one of these turkeys has the key. But I am not powerful enough yet to do that. Yeah, and there's nobody else up here I can trick into fighting this creature. What was the hit points on this thing? 7,000? Yeah, right. Okay, well, that's slightly ridiculous. <laughs> well, that's cool. So we, we at least we know we have a quest over here. That's uh, something we can deal with later. Now, is that water down there? <laughs> Eventually. Sploosh. Glad that uh, we didn't just get killed there. Okay, so up the Rotor Woodlands. Okay. This is yeah, a slightly quicker climb up this one. We'd be, I think we'd be a little tuckered at the end of this. Can I, I, oh I can, there we go, some ginseng. I didn't even look to see if there's anybody like trying to attack us right now. 
I just got all excited because of ginseng. Oh, that's a nook and a cranny, isn't it? Okay, well, let's go up here. Uh, oh, hey, we can... It's so many hits. This cotton is like the toughest thing in the universe. I got a popcorn, a dewdrop. That is the weirdest stuff to get. Why would I get like popcorn? No idea. I guess the last person that was growing cotton also just also happened to be making popcorn and then left some. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, like thirteen hits to get that cotton. But this is good. This is what I was wanting. I don't see any more in my immediate vicinity. Oh, what is that critter? A moose. Well, hello, moose. How many? You're only 300. Oh, you're a little weakling. Yeah, you're like me. You're like me, Mr. Moose. Uh, see, I see these little scumbags over here. Okay, come here. Oh, that's interesting. Those critters didn't, they wanted nothing to do with me as they were in stealth mode. I feel like normally they would have attacked me if I encountered them. So I'm wondering if that's how people see us in stealth mode. There's more up there. So I guess if you're kind of end more over there. So is that, is this the thing? Is that there's a lot of critters in stealth mode around here? If you're not paying attention. It's going to continue along here. Okay. I see a bush over there. I think I want to get over to that. I do see another critter also in stealth mode. There's a lot of stealthiness going on around here. Everybody's sneaking. I think I may have just saw some doggos though. Is that... That is, yes, that's Savage Dogs. Hello, Savage Dogs and Alpha Dog. And Cotton Plant. Yeah, I think I've definitely, I've gotten the sense that, like, I can't just go around trying to dominate an area. It is really just about exploring and, as I go, try to navigate the the wilds and, and get a general feel for things. Oh, I can't even get any more of these cobwebs. Okay, so there's no point getting any more of those. What is that thing? That's a beautiful mana deer again. Oh, that is it's so pretty. Was it? Were you the mana deer I ran into earlier? I'm looking for a wood key, if you got one mana deer. Now, there's some bugs here. I feel like this is almost the area where I was I got uh, in trouble before. So I like that I, I still haven't hit the ceiling on how much wood I can go with. Okay. I think I'm just going to keep on going this way before those bugs start spitting stuff at me. What do we got? Oh, hello. A mana orchid. Those are good. Okay, I think I'm going to go into stealth mode here and take out this bush. And then I go over to the right and see what we can get. Ooh, got another dewdrop. I'm not sure what those are going to do for me yet. I feel like they're good, but who knows. Maybe i got to put those inside the flask or something. Okay, got a couple more of these hearts. That's nice. What? Whoa. Oh my gosh, that was slightly steep. Okay, there we go. I, over here I see a place uh, for us to go and not get murdered. A place for us to respawn to. So let's go send a respawn point over here. And get away from all these snow beetles. I don't like you. You're not nice. All 
Alright, have I played the flute for you before? I don't think so. Oh yeah, snout beetles, take that. Such pretty sounds. Now with all these ferns, I feel like there would be something else going on here. Oh, here we go. Yeah, the, uh, oh boy, the old, old tree here is just kicking the butt out of people. This is good, this is good. We're getting in on this. Oh no. You killed. Oh, we did not survive that. <laughs> oh my gosh. That was brutal. Okay, I went, uh, towards the water, so I went this way. Wow. Well, the tree was happy. For a little while it lasted there. Is this where we... Yeah, okay. This is where we died. Oh, there's still some coins. Perfect. <gasps> oh, hello. A glass flask, one leftovers, and... Uh, some kind of giant sword, it appears. I want to check that out, but I also want to get away from all of that action. What's this about in here? This is... this iron? Oh, good. Perfect. What is this? Oh, that's another one of those... Uh, oh, that's a shimmer mushroom. I don't... That, that's not what I thought it would be. Okay, the tree is battling it out here. I don't think this is going to go well for the tree. That's not true. Oh, no, that's not true. Fighting it out. I thought they were having a battle. That was not a battle. It was not a battle of any kind. Okay, got some cotton. So again, slowly making my way towards the coast. Which was my whole plan here. <laughs> it's a very tedious plan. Oh, there we go. There's a road. What where exactly this leads to. So now I'm not going to bother grabbing any of that other stuff, and I see a cave, so that is a cave I want to go to. And it looks like it leads into the right direction, so let's check that out. Oh, is it? Kind of. Okay, yeah, there's a little iron here. Yep, yeah, we got... Uh, what, three iron nuggets? And a bomb? Well, that's not bad. Okay, and is there any... I just wanted to continue around the other edge. No, there's nothing else in here. All right. Fine. Be like that. Oh, I can't get through here, can I? Oh, whoa. Foliage. I can. I. You know, it is funny. I didn't really realize I could clear out the foliage like that. Whoa. That is like a secret passage. Okay, that's very cool. Why did I just realize this now? <laughs> I feel like I'm going to find some like secret passage into a cave now. We're showing this tree. Oh, hello. There's some lore over here. What is this? Oh, that's apples. Okay, let's go check out this lore. Try to avoid those spinning creatures over there. The Rotor Woodlands were colonized by Cormorians in a certain year of some kind. Okay. Our, our lore increased to 20%. That's good. Okay, so now I was heading over this way, and I got distracted by the fact that I could... Uh, smash the trees. So let's go back up this way. Ultimately, I'm trying to go to the coastline. And I kind of got, yeah, I got to here, and I, I got a little like, oh, oh my gosh, I can do other things. I got distracted. Let's go back on through. That was kind of cool, though. I had no idea. So I guess you would be able to, for instance, 
Oh my gosh, this is a revelation and a half. What? That is bananas. So I can go and like wipe a tree out. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Again, I love that. Just discovering that now. I think because so much of the world seemed non-destructible, it, it didn't even occur to me. Okay, we've got to go invisible for these hulking critters. Anything here? No, it doesn't seem... Oh, here's some cotton. Let's get that. And... So we're definitely heading into a different kind of terrain here. Yeah, oh my gosh. It's funny, it should have occurred to me that because I could get rid of the snow, I would probably also be able to do something else. Okay, here's a, here's a nice tree friend. And a moose. You guys are hanging out together? Oh my gosh. Tree plus moose equals awesome. Okay. You guys, how, how powerful? You're not very powerful. Why don't you all come and follow me? Hey. Hey, tree. And moose. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so the moose is just going to plow all of them. Look at this thing. Okay, so... Oh, whoa. Hold the phone, okay. What? Where is this shrine? The... what? <laughs> That's not quite where I thought I was previously. Did that regen weird? That is really bananas. Okay, so we ended up on an island somehow? Now, hold up. Did I even activate this island thing then? That is really bizarre. So, okay, so these islands do have things. Some of those islands are really far away though. Okay, yeah. Wow. That is bananas. So ultimately, I was trying to get over here to go and get my loot. So I have 145, uh, whatever these units are, 145 gold. Oh. Okay, hold the phone. Now, is there going to be stuff I can get underwater here? Uh, I don't know, uh, but I need to get up because I'm about to drown. Huh. I would imagine there is. There's going to be some resources out here. So maybe this is good that I'm like... I've got a nice save point out by the water. I'm headed back towards that grave because I really want to see if I can collect some of the goodies. I'm going to go invisible. Try to avoid the whatever situation that's going on there. Was it just over here? I'm hoping it is. I don't need that net, the bug net thing. It's, yeah, it's really difficult, I find, to gauge how far away I, I am from the thing. <laughs> I guess I need to look closer at the map, don't I? So I feel like I was running along this trail uh, towards the water. I guess what I could do is go... Yeah, okay. 170 meters. So I, Oh, and there's a little thing. We'll get that. Another little shimmer mushroom. Oh good, okay, so here's the thing. Here's where the battle was. Can I get the loot? That's my big question now. Uh, let's go down. Whoa. Now, am I being chased? I feel like I'm being chased. Nope. And here's the loot. Oh good, it didn't disappear. So I got a handmade linen chest armor. Okay, that could be good. So let's see what we got here. Uh, I can't wear it. 
Okay, that's fine. We can sell it, is what I'm thinking. I'm also thinking then... Oh, look at these critters here. Oh, these are all the slimes I was probably trying to evade earlier. Now, is there anything in this cave? Seems like a big a, enough cave that there should be something in here. Nope. Whoa, 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 whoa. I didn't like that. Is it still following me? Ah! I think it might be. Okay, there's um, some ores. There we go. Perfect. Oh, good. And there might be some more ores around here somewhere. So, at least we, we somehow accidentally made it to shore, which, that's nice. Oh, look at this. Emerald. Oh, boy. I feel like this is what we were kind of waiting for, is this stuff. Because the emeralds, if I recall, were reasonably high price, weren't they? If we go see the gem dude. So this is panning out. Now this goes, what? Where does this go? Okay, this just goes down below again. Back towards where we were. Here's another flower. Oh, another deposit. Two deposits. This is good. I like it when you hit these sweet spots and it's just suddenly resources galore. So it's interesting, after the uh, that very like quiet opening we hit in this game, uh, it is amazing, I guess, how much the game has opened up in terms of like resources, or I guess at least maybe just our understanding by exploring around, we realized more what we had available to us. One iron nugget. And uh, yeah, again, I feel like there's probably still more hiding around here. Because this seems like the kind of place where there is always more hiding around. But this also is a good place for us probably to take a break. And uh, next time we come back, I, yeah, I don't know what we're going to keep on doing. I don't have a specific goal in mind, uh, territory-wise. Oh, we will go invisible because that is bad. What is this here? Oh, that's just scrub. Okay. I don't want those things. <laughs> Those things will do nothing for me. Let's get away from all these, these baddies here. But yeah, next time I think we'll uh, keep on just keeping on. I think, I, I again, I keep meaning to go back to town, but then I keep finding so many resources that we keep running into these little, these beautiful little things where I'm like, oh, you, well, you know, it's, it's difficult to justify going back when we keep exploring and finding so many things because we know back is kind of boring compared to all the stuff we've been finding so it does make me want to just sort of keep on uh, pushing the edges and seeing what else we can run into yeah some of these caves are rather big wow this is the part where I was hoping to run into these sorts of caves where they're just massive and then you don't know uh, what exactly you're gonna get into but I like it so I don't know we've uh, we've explored a huge chunk of map now we're at least learning the names of things. We can see where we've, we've put our path through. That's pretty good. But I also feel like we've barely touched on anything. Like, what is this? What is this? These are such huge regions. Oh my gosh. This is so ridiculous. It's going to take us forever. That's fun, though. All right. We will see you all next time. Till then. Bye-bye.